Thanks for keeping it here, everyone. I'm Eric Connert. And I'm Nettie Irampour. So emotions are running high. Parents and students, they're outraged over a video that shows a Vista High School student getting allegedly assaulted. And now this morning, they're demanding answers and justice. So this one minute video appears to show a hazing incident by Vista High School football players targeting a younger teenage boy. And we've blurred this video because the students are minors. CBS 8's Dana Marie McNichol is live outside of Vista High. And you just got an important update to this story here. Yeah, that's exactly right. We just heard from Poway Unified, the school that Vista High School was supposed to be playing against this Friday. That football game has now been canceled. Vista High School has forfeited. Now, this is all in response to the social media video that surfaced. Parents saw it, was angry, and actually created a protest at the school yesterday, holding signs, chanting things like, we want justice. They actually swarmed a student's car. We have a video of that moment. We also see the sheriff's department intervening. Take a look. Now it all happened last night at Vista High School. Quickly after this group of angry students and parents surrounded the car with a student inside. The sheriff's department rushed onto campus and escorted the group outside of the student parking lot. You can see deputies closing off the gate right there. Now, I did speak to a father who has a student at Vista High School. He says he knows the student that was swarmed. He believes this student was innocent and was targeted solely because he is on the football team. Now, this father is angry at the school's lack of transparency and worried that students not involved will suffer. Now you're looking at video of this morning with officers still remaining on campus. The school did release a written update to the community on the situation. They say the school has completed its investigation and students involved are receiving appropriate sanctions. They also say the purpose of the investigation going forward is to broadly investigate allegations regarding the football program that are being reported. The varsity head football coach will be on leave until the investigation is complete. Now, he did speak to parents at the protest yesterday who want answers and change. Take a listen. It's obviously it's a hazing that goes on every year. How can it be identical? And I just want everybody to know it's not a one time thing. Now, the father that we spoke to actually told us he's keeping his daughter from school for the rest of the week, not in protest, but just to keep her safe from this hostile environment. He's describing inside of Vista High School. Again, tomorrow's football game against Poway High School has been forfeited. Vista has decided to cancel that game. Now, of course, parents are still going to be wanting answers, so we will follow up and uh, give you updates as they develop. I'm Dana Marie McNichol coming to you live from Vista High School.